and the burden of doom. Yes. The people of Seir called out to the prophet saying, Watchman, Amen. what of the night? Watchman, what of the night? And the prophet answered, The morning cometh, but also the night. Amen. Amen. I want to talk this morning about what time is it? What time is it? Take the time to reach good. Back during the biblical days, one of the urban offices or positions yeah. that was mandatory for the preservation of law, order, and safety Amen. was the position of the watchman. Yeah. Amen. It was the duty of the watchman yeah. to, to patrol the streets of the city through the course of the night. Amen. Amen. It was the duty of the watchman to prevent thieves yeah. and vagabonds from prowling about through the dark. Yeah. The watchman was to shout out an alarm yeah. whenever there was imminent danger. Jonah. Jonah. The watchman was to shout the time of the night. Amen. And to inform the citizenry of the various changes in the weather. Amen. The people of the cities, when they listened from their bedsides yeah. to the stern, firm, regular steps of the watchman passing by their door. Amen. They felt a sense of security and would thrust themselves in confidence into the arms of sleep. At the entrances and exits of all of the cities just above the walls, there were towers frequently built where the watchman stood to gaze upon the horizon and give the city warning whenever danger was approaching. Amen. And those towers that the watchmen stood in were called watchtowers. But no one watchman could afford to watch all night long. No, no, no. For it was necessary that a watchman be alert. Yeah. Yeah. That he be on guard. Therefore, they only watched three hours at a time. Yeah. 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 And through the course of the night, there were four different watches. Yeah. Yeah. The first watch was from six in the evening to nine at night. The second watch was from nine to twelve midnight. The third watch was from midnight to three in the morning. And the fourth watch was from three in the morning to six o'clock in the morning. All during the course of the night, the citizens of the city would shout out to the watchman on the wall, yeah. Watchman, what of the night? Yeah. In other words, what time is it? Amen. And the watchman would shout out, it is the second watch. Yeah. And the inquirer would automatically know that it was somewhere between 9 and 12. Amen. If he shouted out, it is the third watch, they knew that it was somewhere between 12 and 3. Yes. But all through the night, they would shout out to the watchman on the wall, yeah. Watchman? Yeah. What of the night? Yeah. Now, this particular scene or setting was familiar to every Jew in Jerusalem. Yeah. This 
was just as common for the Jews keeping up with the time as it is for us to look at our watches and clocks and tell what time it is. Amen. Amen. So God, since he knew that every Jew was familiar with keeping time sure by questioning the watchman on the wall, yeah. God took this, this setting in order to give his people a spiritual message. The question watchman, what of the night? Was the people of Seir asking the prophet in Jerusalem, what time is it? We've had so many problems and suffering. Looks like the night ought to end. Tell us, watchman, what of the night? What time is it? How much longer do we have to lay in wait? How much more do we have to bear? How long do we have to suffer? Watchman, is the daybreak near? Watchman, do you see streaks of daylight? Watchman, is the day long coming? Tell us, watchman, what of the night? What time is it? How long do we have to lay here? And of course, the watchman answered back, the morning coming. Still don't worry. You are Abraham's descendant. The morning is coming. When you'll be able to get up and refresh yourselves and feed your family. The morning coming. When you'll be able to wear sufficient clothes. The morning comes. When the curtain of decadence will be thrown back. The morning comes. And before Seir can shout, before the people of Seir can get happy about the prophet saying that the morning comes, he turns around and says, but also the night. In other words, you're going to have some good time. But right behind that going to be some bad time. The morning comes. But also the night. Watchman, what of the night? You know, children, a man doesn't have to be listed in the who's who to know what's what today. But as a man stands with his newspaper in one hand and the Bible in the other hand, as a man stands with his eyes Focused on the television and with his ears tuned to the radio, uh, we can hear astounding world events tumbling in rapid succession over each other, rushing on to ruin. Civilization is being torn down by degradation, threatened with doom and disaster. These are times wherein the high-mindedness yeah. is running the streets like a mad dog, yeah. beating an uncertain path. Yeah. Selfishness yeah. has evaporated the milk of human kindness. Yeah. Pain and panic yeah. are chasing each other like June bugs yeah. in the summer sun. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Uh, paradise has been turned into pandemonium. <laughs> And puny men are pending and patenting yeah. in the passing of days. Yeah. As a result of science magic, distance has disappeared. Yeah. No longer do we measure distance by the mind, but we measure distance now by the eye. Yeah. You understand me? Yeah. Isolation is dead and buried. Never to have another resurrection. Uh, We 
we have none yet. We are supposed to live, but we can't live without each other. But still we have not learned to live with each other. We are interrelated and we are interdependent. But we still have learned how to get along. And I hear echoing, rumbling and roaring in a distance. Watchman, what of the night? What time is it? What of the night? You know, we're living in times wherein names are changing. In the past 20 years, names have made a complete revel and evolution. Here's what I'm talking about. 20 years ago, we used to call folk who collect garbage, garbage men. Now we call them sanitary workers. We used to call folk who sweep the floors janitors. But now we call them maintenance men. We used to call the furnace cleaners uh, heating cleaners, but now we call them heating technicians. We used to call the old folk old folk, but now we call them senior citizens. Uh, We used to call inflation inflation, but now we call it economic sophistication. We used to name when we killed people capital punishment. But now when we put them in jail, we call it rehabilitation. Huh? Uh, We used to call people that get drunk, drunkenness. Now we call it alcoholism. Times have changed. That is a great big gut. That's a great big mountain. That's a huge valley between us. So far as being able to adequately communicate. We don't know how to communicate. Just look in the family. In the family. Uh, Mamas don't know what children talking about no more. We using the same words, but they mean different things. Mama takes certain words to mean one thing when Johnny is talking about something else. Here's what I'm talking about. Here's exactly what I'm talking about. Uh, Johnny, you know, comes home and says, Mama, my friend just got back off a trip. Ain't that pitiful? And Mama is so naive, Mama thinks, that Johnny's talking about her, his friend just got back from California. Or just got back from New York. But yet mama can't understand why Johnny says, ain't that pitiful. When Johnny talking about my friend been on a trip, he's talking about my friend just got back off a high. You understand? Oh yeah, I'm right this morning too. You understand me? Uh, 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 uh. Johnny comes home and tells Papa, said, Daddy, uh, I got to have me a pad. Is it all right? Daddy said, oh, yeah, go and get a pad. Because to Daddy, a pad is what you write on or what you sit on. When Johnny is talking about he got to have him a park minute. Johnny comes home and says, Daddy, I got to have me some wheels. That's a boy, don't get your wheel. He thinks he got to have a wheel for his bicycle. When Johnny talking about he got to have a car. Johnny come home and tell his mama, say, mama, you know, Ben got arrested for the possession of grass. When mama scratched his head, grass. What, they going to put the boy in jail for cutting the lawn? When, 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 when John is talking about the fact that, 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 that his friend got caught for the possession of marijuana. Huh? John come home, you understand? I'm going to leave it alone to tell you this. John come home. You know, 
and use the word mom. Yeah. And mom is a respected word, yeah. a reverent word, a word where when we talk about the feminine gender of one of the parents, yeah. that's what grandmama think mama is. Yeah. But when Johnny said mama, Johnny talking about his bro. <laughs> you know, you know, hey there mama. <laughs> mama, you sure look good. I sure did you, Mama. Mama, I sure want to get next to you. There is a vast gulf between Mamas and Papas. There's a great big generation gap. Since Mamas don't understand their children, since children don't understand their mamas and papas. Yeah. Don't you hear? Yeah. The question echoing watchman. Yeah. What are the night? Yeah. What time yeah. is it? Yeah. Well, children, we're living in dark times. Yeah. We're living in a jazzed up, sex drenched society. Yeah. We're living in a time where an hour. Society is dying yeah. from moral decay. Yeah. We're living in times, you understand? Yeah. Where when you gotta wade through a whole mile of filth yeah. to find one inch of purity. Yeah. We're living in a nice age yeah. that's sick on compromise yeah. and dying from no convictions. Yeah. These are times. Wherein we've got power, yeah. but we don't have no peace. No, no. Oh, yeah. We got bones, yeah. but we don't have no beliefs. No, no. We got jets, yeah. but we don't have no justice. No, no. We got strength, yeah. but we don't have no security. No, no. And in time like this, yeah. I hear the question, no, no. Watchman. What? What are the night? Instead of us talking about the gospel of St. Mark, yeah. our society is proclaiming the gospel yeah. according to Karl Marx. Yeah. Watchman, yeah. what are the night? Yeah. It's dark. Yeah. It's grim and grim and cloudy. Yeah. It's gloomy, misty, hazy. Yeah. It's fuzzy. Yeah, Watchman, what of the night? Yeah. Oh, just look at the time. Man has taken, gone out of his education. A yeah. few years ago, the Supreme Court yeah. made it unlawful yeah. for my child in public school yeah. to bow down and say the Lord's Prayer. Yeah. And to repeat a Bible verse. Yeah. Watchman. Yeah. What of the night? Yeah. We have taken morality yeah. out of our literature. Yeah. I don't care where you go. You can't find nothing decent to read no more. Yeah. You go all the way around to the newsstand. And everything is nasty, dirty talk. Yeah. Yeah. Salaciousness oh, yeah. drips from the pens of our authors. Yeah. Yeah. Pornography is witnessing a booming, yeah. landslide business. Yeah. Yeah. We've taken, you understand, our oh, virtue yeah. out of our drama. Yeah. Every new movie yeah. that comes out is rated X. Yeah. And classified adults only. Yeah. Every time you look on television, somebody kissing, yeah. hugging, yeah. feeling and rubbing. Yeah. You understand me? Yeah. And there are children in the dens and living rooms yeah. exposed to curse words, yeah. obscene language. Yeah. Yeah, they're always pouring a drink. Oh. Every scene in a the picture, they gotta have a drink. And then when the advertising come on, yeah. the commercial is talking about an intoxicating booze. Yeah. And they're my child. Yeah. 
and your child in his den and living room. Yes. Look at all that junk. Yes, sir. What else can they be but these? Yes. Hoodlums and thugs. Yes. Watchmen. Yes. Lord have mercy. Yes. What all the night? Yes. Man yes. has taken beauty yes, sir. all out of his art. Yes. I ain't art no more. No, no. For beauty's sake. Or for art's sake. Yeah. But nowadays art is art. Yeah. For sex's sake. Yeah. You see, we don't think a man has painted a pretty picture. Yeah. And a man ain't painting no beautiful sculpture. No, no. If it ain't some nudity in it. Yeah. Every picture you see of a painting before you say it's pretty. Yeah. It's got to be one of them old naked pictures. Yeah. You know, everybody buying jets. Yeah. And Playboy magazines yeah. just so they can turn to the center page yeah. and see somebody's pride hanging all out. These are dark, these are dark, grim, cloudy times. Watchmen, what are the night? Lord have mercy. Times are rough, times are dark. We ain't got no ethics in our business no more. That used to be a time that in business, a man's word was his bond. Don't you remember that? A man's word was his contract. But now the lying and stealing and cheating and dishonesty is considered as a shrewd business. Con art. I'm not out in the world no more. Yeah. But you got con artists trying to be yeah. right here in the church. Yeah. Uh, uh, uh. Every time you're going to make some kind of business arrangement, yeah. you got to draw up a contract. Yeah. You got to go a high lawyer. Yeah. And even when you get a lawyer, you better read the fine print yeah. before you sign your name. Yeah. And now, yeah. you can't trust nobody. Now, no. but everybody crooked. Yes. Now, no. but everybody scheming, yes. cheating. Yes. Tell me, watchman, yes. yes. what are yes. the night? Yes. What are 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 the night? No more. Yeah. No. Ain't nobody coming around the altar trying to be bound yeah. in the holy bond of matrimony. Yeah. Marriage ain't nothing now but a 90 day option. Yeah. Yeah. Don't nobody want to get married. Yeah. All everybody want to do is shout. Yeah. You stay with me and get married and go when you want to and come back. Yeah. We ain't doing nothing but shacking, yeah. laying and playing. Wine and dining. Watchman. Lord have mercy. With the husbands going with other wives. With wives going with other husbands. With men going with men. And yeah, women going with women. Tell me, watchman, what are the men?
and we've liquorized our society. Yeah. Everything is anti. Yeah. Anti-Bible. Yeah. Anti-Christ. Yeah. Anti-God. Yeah. Anti-Holy Ghost. Yeah. Anti-Church. Yeah. Anti-anything the spiritual. Yeah. Tell me, Watchman, in these dark times, Watchman, what are the night? times 
that we are now living in. Greg Garner, we're living in times wherein satanic forces all over our world. And Satan and all of his imps are now permeating our land. Greg Garner, and we're living in dark times. Wherein black magic, hoodoo and voodoo, is on a constant rise. Gregor, we're living in time wherein there are no more dynamic relationships. No, we're just like sand on the sea. Though we are touching each other. Why, there's still no vital links. Great and we're living in time wherein sharing is a rarity. And these are times wherein we got information without inspiration. And we got communication without communion. And though we talk with one another, we still don't have no togetherness. Hold on. And our space is being conquered. Mm, but in a distance it uh, still remains mm, oh yes it does and in these dark uh, and chaotic times uh, don't y'all hear the question coming watchman uh, what of the night mm, brethren and it's dark uh, and it's gloom Mm, tell us, watchman, uh, what time is it? Mm, brother, you know, here we are, winding down uh, toward the end of another year. Mm, and uh, as we look back uh, over 1976, uh, mm, why, there's some of us who say, Lord, every time I try to make a step forward. Mm. Somebody was always there to pull me back. Mm. Oh, Lord. It's kind of like Paul said, every time I go to do good, evil is always there. Mm. Oh, Lord. And watchmen in these dark times, yeah, we want to hear from you. Mm. Tell us, Lord, what of the night where we heard what Richard Nixon said. Yeah, we know now that the answer ain't in phase one, two, nor three. Oh, no, it ain't. We know, Lord, that Jerry Ford didn't have the answer. Oh, no, it ain't. We know that the Supreme Court, mm, not our Congress, uh, can give us the answer. Mm, oh, no, we can. And here we are, wondering how long, mm, oh, long, how long must we lay in wait? Mm, how long must we suffer? Mm, we ain't going nowhere until you tell us. Mm, oh, Lord, is there any word from the Lord? Oh, Lord, I wish somebody would pray with me. Mm, ready. We want to know mm, what of the night. Mm, talk to us. Mm, speak to us. Mm, speak to me, Jesus. Uh, tell me thy will. Mm, in thy soft uh, and gentle voice, uh, speak to me still. Uh, hold on. While I'm waiting uh, here at the altar, mm, give me a faith uh, that will not falter. 
talk to us. Mm. Say something. Mm. We want to hear from you. I ain't going to be satisfied till you answer my question. What of the night? Mm. Oh, Lord. We're not wanting love a whole lot. Mm. Oh, no, we don't. We just want to live joy. Mm. We just want to live happiness. We just want to smile sometime. Mm. Lord, we're tired of moaning and groaning, mm. crying and sighing all the time. Mm. Tell us, talk to me, what of the night? Mm. But a hush, wait a minute. Mm. Listen, I hear somebody trying to talk to him. Mm. The Lord told me to tell you the morning come. Mm. Yes, it does. The morning come when the morning star shall shine. Mm. The morning come when the laughing lilies mm, and the fragrant robots mm, will twine around the woodbine and show off the glory of a coming daybreak. Mm. The morning come. Mm. Yes, it does. Yeah, it ain't gonna be night time all the time. No, behind night comes day. Behind every cloudy day, the sun sure shine. And hush, I hear him talking. Listen, don't y'all hear him sing? Morning come, but there's gonna be some night. Mm, yeah, did not tell you that the day was gonna come mm, when you couldn't tell summertime from wintertime. Mm, yeah, did not tell you the time was coming mm, when I was gonna be fathers against some, mm, mamas against daughters, mm, husbands against their wives. Did not tell you it was gonna be dark. And go, mm, yeah, but wait, morning come. Mm, that's gonna be a last night. Mm, and you know, sometimes I feel that our time ain't long. Mm, you know, children, we're living in the last day. Mm, oh, yes, we are. Time coming when the sun going out to in all of acid. Mm. The moon breath pressure is going up sky high and run down in blood. Mm. Time coming. Mm. Yeah. When the sea going to ball like a giant pot. Mm. When the sky will crack like glass. Mm. When the history will roll up like a scroll. Mm. Time coming. Mm. When the end gonna run to the rock. Mm. Try to hide their faith. Mm. But all the rock will cry out. No hide and play. Yes, it will. All the time. Can I get a witness there? Time is coming. Yes, it is. But God told me to tell you. Mm. Behind that dark night, uh, there will be a morning uh, that knows no night. Mm -hmm. Yeah, uh, Lord, what you doing? Mm -hmm. What you doing to us? Uh, God said, well, uh, I'm in labor. Mm -hmm. I'm just like a pregnant woman uh, trying to give birth uh, to a new world's order. Mm -hmm. Yes, I am. The dark is our is just before dawn. Mm -hmm. The most pain you have is right before birth. Mm -hmm. Yes, it is. Lord, talk to me. I hear him saying, tell my people, don't worry. Mm -hmm. I know it's dark, but I'm getting ready to make me a new heaven and a new earth. Mm -hmm. I'm getting ready to call my will home. Yes, I am. I'm coming 
like a thief in the night. My hair will be like sheep wool. My feet like polished bread. Oh, yeah. Like balls of fire. Kneecaps are going to be like diamond. High like a rainbow. Got king of king on my left leg. I got laws of lords on my right leg. He coming. I said he coming. Oh, I'm looking for him. I know he's on his way. In the morning, when morning comes, I'm all right. Can I get a witness here? Yeah! Oh, in the morning, do I have a witness here? Oh, in the morning, oh, in the morning, I'm on my way. And, and when the morning comes, I might be dead, sleeping in my grave. When y'all roll me down the aisle, you're going to take me and lay me down in some hole somewhere six feet deep. And while I'm laying there dead, the worm going to come along and eat up my flesh. And, and, and then the bed going to come along and eat up the worm. And then the hawk going to come along and eat up that bird. And then the eagle coming, going to eat up the hawk. But I'm waiting when the morning comes. My rock, in a weary line, going to put one foot on the sea. Set the no man and tell old Gabriel, sound the trumpet. Come and eat it. Hey, wake him up. It's morning time. Hey, the eagle going to give up the hawk. The hawk going to give up the bird. The bird going to give up the worm. The worm will give up my flesh. So that morning, when this life is over, I fly. Way somewhere to be at rest. I'll be there in the morning when night time over. I'm looking for when the saints go marching in. I'm going sweeping. I'm going sweeping in that city. I'll be there. Can I get a witness there? Somewhere. Somewhere. Somewhere, that glad morning, I'm gonna do that. I'm not chosen, just anywhere, anywhere, oh, anywhere, oh, anywhere. When 
the morning. Don't y'all hear my rock in a weary land? San Jasper, the night time is over. Don't you preach no more. Morning, 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 don't come. Close up the hymn book. Don't you sing what a friend we have in Jesus. Don't sing it no more. Don't you sing. Pass me not. Oh, gentle Savior. Don't you sing. When I read my title there, don't you sing. Charge to keep my hat. Singing time is all over. Close up the hymn book and Bible. Close up the Genesis, Exodus, Leviticus, Numbers, and Deuteronomy. Joshua, Judges, Ruth, First and Second Samuel, First and Second King, and First and Second Chronicles. Clap! Ezra, Esther, Job, Psalm, Proverbs, Ecclesiastes, and the Song of Solomon. Clap! The Lamentation. Isaiah, Jeremiah, Ezekiel, Daniel, Moses, Joel, Amos, and Obadiah. Clap! Nehum, Hebeka, Zephaniah, Hegah, Zachariah, Malachi, you close up uh, Matthew, Mark, uh, Luke, and John, uh, Ask the Apostle, the Epistle Romans, uh, Galatians, Ephesians, uh, Hebrews, and James, uh, call up her, uh, first and second Timothy, first and second Thessalonians, first and second Peter, first and second third John, Jude, and Revelation, call up her, in a weary land, step up her, in the laboratory of power, turn the switch of gravity in the worship. And two, by two, Lord, I'm going to walk up and down the golden streets of peace. I'm looking for it. Somewhere, we all be there. Somewhere, can I look for you? Somewhere, will you be there? Somewhere. Sometimes I've been down 